Hey YouTube, Vinny here for another cap of the week and this week we are going to take a look at a classic cap, the Los Angeles Dodgers primary cap. Now this cap has in, been in different forms since 1958 when the team moved here but it's just a classic design. Uh, you have your block letters, L and A intersecting. I believe recently the team adjusted the logo, I think maybe one or two years ago. So it's a little bit finer, thinner uh, modifications that were made, but basically it's the same cap, um, you know, to the test of time. And, and that's what you want in a baseball cap. I think you want a design that's simple, but it works, it's elegant. I mean, we have examples of sometimes when you go a little too crazy, but it's still, you know, great design. But sometimes, in my opinion, simple is the best. So let's take a look. Now, this is a New Era Pro Model cap. This is circa 1991. Now, this, I believe, is one of the last iterations of caps that were made without the Major League logo on the back. It's got the Diamond Collection logo, but this is a different logo that was phased in um, in 92 as well with the Major League logo on the back. And you don't have one here. And you have a simple size 7 and 1 8. And you've got your green underbrim, so it actually fits perfect. It's one of my favorite fitted caps, um, just for comfort wise. Um, I think anytime I'm in LA, I'm always wearing this cap, and so they made it really well. So the team itself has had an illustrious history, and it was an acrimonious uh, way of the team leaving Brooklyn, of course, uh, in 1950s, at the end of 1957. Um, so the team played in LA at the LA Coliseum from 1958 to 1961, which was insane because it was a football stadium. and. It was 250 down the left field line, but they had like a 40 foot like fence. So, you know, if you were able to get a ball high, high enough at uh, Fenway Park, you got some good home runs. So um, what's in, what makes this uh, cap special though, is that this cap has pretty much one thing in common, and that's Vin Scully. And uh, 2016, we believe is the last year of Vin Scully will be calling Dodgers games. Uh, just had a chance listening to him for spring training games. He is still on top of his game. Um, I do think he's the best ever um, with respect to telling a story and being so well prepared and even in his advanced age, you know, he's never missed a beat. And so it'll be different, you know, especially next year uh, when the team wears his cap on the field and he won't be calling their games at Dodger Stadium. But, you know, the team has done so well. I believe they've won World Series in 59, 63, 65. Um, I think they also won an 80, 81 and 88. So they definitely have been a very good franchise and they're trying to get back to the World Series. So we'll see what happens uh, this year. But one thing you can't uh, complain about the Dodgers and that's that's just the way they wore their caps because it's a simple cap and a, you know, it reminds me of the movie Sandlot, you know, we had Jet Rodriguez wearing this. But uh, anyway, it's a little too much for information for now. So until next week, see ya.